Hey Stampers, it's the Pampered Stamper, and I know that some of you guys have been having troubles logging into the Demonstrator website, so I'm going to show you how to save you some serious frustration. So I've got a new tab here, and I'm just going to go to www.stampinup.com, okay? And now it shows up and see how it says USA on the top left corner. I'm going to click on that. I want Canada English or Canada French, whatever. And then when it switches, this is where it gets really weird. Now you want to go to the heart button here at the top. Click on the heart. And then instead of signing in, you want to go here, sign into the demonstrator website. And it's just taking its time. It doesn't want to let me do this, but... You know, it's been that kind of a day. There, click on that. And then it automatically signed me in because I'm signed in on this computer. But normally a box would show up here and you would put in your demonstrator um, ID number and the password, okay? Now, if you have not updated your password yet, if Stampin' Up! sent you an email, and you didn't get, you haven't changed it, and it's too late and you can't sign in, then just call Stampin' Up. It's 1-800-STAMP-UP, and just tell them you need a new password. But otherwise, you're going to go to ordering, and then you're going to go to demonstrator order. And then, then you can just do all the, everything is saved, you hit save. You can also, if you want your order to come more quickly, you can switch this to FedEx. Now, that will cost you $34.99, but then you usually get it in two business days, as long as you place your order before 10 a.m. During COVID, it's not guaranteed, but yeah, it's worth it sometimes. But otherwise, you just do this, hit save, and then you can add your stuff in here. Okay, now I'm just going to, let's see if I have a catalog handy here. Yeah. Let's just put in the the stamp, the die cut machine. That's a nice big item. So I'm going to go 149653, enter. Okay. So I've got the stamp and die cut machine. And let's just add the mini just for fun. 150673. Okay. There we go. See now. It tells me my order is at $245. I have four level one celebrations or two level two remaining. So I'm going to put in, let's see, I want the hummingbird set. Okay, so I'm looking at my, you're, gonna, you're going to find your, here, just let me take that out just a second. This is where you find your celebration freebies. Okay, and for a level two means that it's for a hundred and twenty dollars so the berry blessings is one of your options or the hummingbird so i'm going to go for the hummingbird because i already have a bunch of berry blessings this is the hummingbird it's called the touch whoops the touch of ink okay so we'll pop, pop that in and it's one five five two three three and then hit enter and there we go. See, and now it tells me I have two level one rewards or one level two. So let's, I want the donkeys. So let's find him. The donkeys is one, five, five, two, six, four, hit enter. And then it tells me I have one level one reward left and I will get uh, the approaching perfection. Oops. This is really bad. But anyway, um, one, five, five, two, eight, two. Okay. There we go. So now I have that done. See, it says I have zero left. So now I'm going to go hit continue. And then it's going to tell me, okay, redeem stamp and rewards. And over here, it says I have $24.50 in free stamp and rewards. So let's see, what do I want to do? I would like to get uh, the label me fancy punch. It's 151297. Hit enter. And now I have 50 cents left. So I can go over by a little bit. See, let's say I'm going to do add the foil sheets. And I'm over by a little bit. And there we go. See, it doesn't know 50% off. I can add my payment options here. And then I hit save. And then it's done. So I hope that helped you guys.